So do you wanna know how you can speed wrap your videos within LumaFusion? Well, in this video, I'm gonna show you how. Hey there, welcome to the video. I'm Mark Brown from Editor's Keys, and today I'm gonna to show you how you can do speed ramping within LumaFusion. Now, if you've clicked on the video and you're new to LumaFusion, or you just don't know what speed ramping is, you may have seen it on some TV adverts. It's essentially an effect where a clip may be going at normal speed, and then it slows right down. It shows you a bit of focus within a video clip, and then it speeds up and goes back to normal speed. So I'm gonna show you how you can do that within LumaFusion. It's not actually built in, so I'll show you the technique that we use to achieve it when we're editing our footage within the iPad. Uh, also, if you are filming in slow motion and you're filming at a high frame rate, you wanna make sure your shutter speed is twice that of your frame rate. So if you're at 30 frames a second, you want your shutter speed to be 60, and if you're doing 100 frames a second, you want it to be 200. And this just means that you don't get any sort of glitching or strobing effects on your video but let's jump straight into it and show you how it's done so here are some clips that i'm going to be using first you want to set your in and out points by clicking these icons on this line here below your video or if you have a keyboard attached like a smart keyboard you can press the i key to mark in and the o key to mark out to insert it into your timeline click this icon here the one with the arrow pointing down with two rectangles. Or the shortcut for this is the W key. Now, when you have your clips ready, find a spot where you want to speed up or slow down. So for this example, I want the slow motion to start here, just as where the back of the T-shirt comes into frame. So all you do is cut the clip with a scissor tool or use Command B. Now go over to where you'd like the slow motion to end and then cut the clip again. Now double tap the clip to go into the edit mode. And then you want to go into the speed and reverse section. And then lower this to about one quarter speed. And there you go, it's as simple as that. If you want to increase the speed, do the same process, but instead raise this bar to about two or whatever your preferred choice is. So just a word of caution, if you've got a 30 FPS timeline and you've got some lovely slow motion footage in 60 FPS, you could essentially slow that footage down by half before the footage starts to deteriorate. Okay, so just some extra tips on achieving a really nice speed ramp within LumaFusion. Because within LumaFusion, unlike uh, something like Final Cut, it's not possible to add, at the moment, kind of a 10%, a 20%, a 30% increase in speed as you go. You kind of have to make these cuts. What you wanna do is add the cut when your camera is moving. So what I would recommend is when you go out filming, think of this, keep this in mind for your LumaFusion projects. Uh, think of the cut when your camera is in motion and moving because it will look so much better. For example, if you look at the shot of the Google sign, uh, because the camera is moving to the right, when I change the speed, it's nice and smooth. So I always think it's best to add these uh, slow motion effects or these cuts when you have motion in your camera and go from normal to slow or normal to fast and that works much better. Now you can actually zoom right in and if you want you can make uh, two or three or four cuts and then have one which is 25% and then 50 and then 75 to kind of get that that jumping sort of speed ramp. But sometimes I think just a, a simple cut from normal to slow or, or normal to fast works much better. So anyway, let us know, experiment with your footage and let us know in the comment section below how you get on. So thanks for watching. And as mentioned before, we've got a ton of LumaFusion tutorials coming. So make sure you stay locked to the Editor's Keys channel and I'll see you in the next one.